It is the next chapter in Apple's story. So if I press the digital crown at the top here, it takes me out to my applications. Very easy to get out to my apps. Now when I'm here, you can see the clock is the center of the universe. And the apps you frequently use, you might put around the clock here. You can arrange these how you like. And I can pan just by simply swiping on the screen here. So let's get walking directions to Whole Foods. So it's figuring out the best way to get there now. And I'm going to press start. It's going to do a little simulated walk to, so you can see how it goes here. Now while you're walking, Apple Watch will give you taptic feedback on each turn so you'll know whether it's time to turn left or to turn right. And those feelings are different for each direction. So you can actually know without even looking at your watch which way to go. It's like having this invisible guide with you. We have two new applications in Apple Watch. The first is the fitness app. The fitness app monitors all of your activity and movement throughout the day. And the second is the workout app. The workout app allows you to set specific goals for specific types of workouts, like cycling or running. And so we've designed it so that it's simple to charge at night. Apple Watch starts at only $349. And it will be available early next year.